Hello, I'm Fantastic and Fantastic, and today I'm going to be doing various roles in the Super Player's Choice Godfest. So, this Player's Choice Godfest features a 43.6% chance of getting any Godfest exclusive, along with a 1.6% chance of getting the Rem Draws, so essentially a 45% chance of getting something of true value. I consider Rem Draws useful because it's bonus rolls, and any Godfest exclusive is meaningful because at the absolute very worst, they become trade fodder. And for the Godfest exclusives that were voted in, I think the voting was pretty cool. For the Pantheons, I'm a little confused why it's Sakuya, Nohimi, and Ra, but that is okay. We are gonna instead just let the good times roll, and hopefully Fantastic can get some pretty fantastic rolls. All right, come on, big money. I want to glow, because that means seven stars or higher, which means it's not those silly six-star Pantheon cards. Come on, big money. Okay, that's small money. That's not Sagri, that looks like Kamal. No, very unfortunate. Do you have a weapon assist? Oh, you do have a weapon assist. Not really that excited about it, though. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe I'll just make it to have it. But you know what? Free rolls are free rolls. You can't expect anything particularly good. What do I get for five rolls? I'm just curious. Does it make it go so much faster is the problem? What's the multi-five? Oh, it's pies. Ah. I do get pies. I do like pies. Is apple pie my favorite? I feel like apple pie is like the classic pie, but I am a big fan of strawberries. All right, it's 10 pies. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Alrighty, so, Edion, Hank, Shadow have all said hello to their future selves along with Shory P and Boto Balls. We are going to now do a 5 pull so I get 10 skill ups. It's Pumpkin Pie for Hank Tank, interesting. Alrighty, this drains your stones so much faster. I'm a big fan of stalling out my excitement and joy. I like to roll it one by one, but I know that I should have the extra resources. I know I should. So, come on, we want... Lots of glowing eggs. There are so many things Fantastic doesn't own. I see some seven stars I own. Lu, Raijin, Diao Qian. Who is this? Camilla! I am dungeon boosting extraordinaire, ladies and gentlemen. I am dungeon boosted as extraordinaire. They are the only card, if I'm not mistaken, that can have four dungeon bonus awakenings through their super awakenings. So, button farming by myself is big money and big times indeed. This roll was pretty sad overall, I feel, for the most part. But you know what? This card alone kind of helped offset some of the pain. And when I think about it, Fantastic has got most of these new six-star cards. So, like, good for him. Okay, there is a Nay in there. I can't tell who that second card is. They all look similar to me. Was that a Guard of Isaac Schluzer or is that Alcyon? No, it's not. Okay. Do you have a weapon yet? Oh, you do. It's probably a similar skill boost killer. Uh, it's situationally useful. I will make it one day. Fantastic. Follow but yeah. Around. Wow. I got a nay. Alrighty. Let's try that again. And thank you so much to Love Anime Dads for becoming a fantastic follower. Who is your favorite anime dad on that note? Alrighty. Let us think. We want to do a bit more. We want to get some exciting rolls. And to be fair, Camila was exciting. Whenever it glows, I get excited. So come on, big money, big money. Okay, so either it's a bunch of new seven stars or disappointment. Seven star or higher, ladies and gentlemen. Come on, big money, big money. Oh, you are not what I want. <laughs> You are not what I want. I guess it's my first El Getty. I guess it's... I didn't even know these cards got weapon assist. I just completely forgot. Come on, new things. Holy fish, that is a painful roll. Four Pantheons? Be good, be exciting. Get out of here, gung-ho. Really? There should really be some sort of pity system in this game when you think about it. Like... Five rolls, five pantheons? That is like, why? What year is this? It's like we're back to 2012 or 2010 pad. That is actually just a colossal disaster of 50 stones, ladies and gentlemen. Most sad indeed. 2016? No, like the beginning of pad almost. Ugh, so much pain and sadness. I guess on the bright side, Fantastic took the bad luck. But it's still painful. I'm just gonna like, take a picture of that for future reference. Okay, so you know what? 
it can only get better than this. Like, there's no way it can be worse. Like, there is nothing that could, there's no world that would be worse than that because those are five pantheons that were like not as exciting. Like, Antares at least has some excitement. I think Kenshin is, in all honesty, a good pantheon card just because he has nice forms. So, we're gonna find out that Kale Bad's prediction of five for five Godfest exclusives will come true, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, a seven star I already have. Maybe it's exciting. Lou again. Hey, six star dude. A seven star girl. I got these already. Alrighty, I can make weapons. See, two out of five is not so bad overall, ladies and gentlemen. Wait, Kenshin didn't get voted in? Oh, that is saddening if it was. Two for five is still better than zero for two. Do I want to do one more? I'll do one more five pull, I feel. I've got almost no new cards when I think about it. Last one, Fantastic has dropped to 90 stones. Oof, I really hope Gung Ho gives us a bunch more. Come on, big money, big money, big, big, big. So some seven stars I've got already. Orochi, Cecilia, Eshimali, okay, three God Fest exclusive. This was kind of trade fodder, but not as good rates as other events. <laughs> Alrighty, a little scammed indeed though, for sure. Alrighty, like, let's count my results. Like, nothing new, unfortunately, but again, trade fodder, so to speak. Like, I got two of these girls. I guess I could make her weapon assist if I really wanted to. I now have two of these guys, so I can make one of these cool weapon assists. Like, if I ever get to play Blue Rose again, this is the team. This is a weapon assist that makes me excited, because Blue Rose are fun. Blue Rose, Combo, and Sub Attribute, also most exciting. Yeah, exciting times, and an exciting character overall. Okay, but I got some pies. So, if I ignore the freebie roll, I got two lose somehow. One, two, three. Okay, how many Godfets exclusive out of 15 rolls? Was it 15? Yes. One, two, very sad. Three, four, five, six, seven. So you know what? I came out pretty close. I just got about that much when I think about it. Like, I got about the expected rates. It kind of picked it up at the end. There's... Three at the end helped for sure. It's a little better, a little less painful, but that zero for five was definitely a lot of pain. But with that being said, let us switch to my other account. Okay. Bum, ba da dum. Alrighty. So I managed to clear the zero title earlier. So, you know, just some big energy vibes there. We're going to go to my mailbox to get my free roll. Oh, I get a title. I already have this title. Yeah. Oh, I, I like Hello Kitty title. I don't know. I think the Hello Kitty title is pretty. Let's try that again. Okay. We're going to go Super Player Shorts Godfest. We're going to get the free roll, and it's going to be beautiful. Dukes just says they're rolling on their alt at the same time as me. And the highlight, you got Shiny and Batty. That sounds exciting. Come on. Give me the little bloblets. You want... I don't want another Elfride, Jake. No more Elfrides. Diversity is good, ladies and gentlemen. Diversity is good. It is not. It is Alatu. It is Alatu, ladies and gentlemen. Bum. Ba -da -dum. I have enough Alatus, and she doesn't have a weapon assist yet. But you know what? It is a free roll. I can't complain too badly. Like, it's free. Like, I expect nothing, and I'm sometimes still disappointed. Sometimes still disappointed. Okay. Bum. Ba -da -dum. <laughs> you got the S and B. Shiny and baddie. Oh, that sounds beautiful. Alrighty. Come on, big money. Come on, let's get a fantastic roll. A gold egg? Get out of here. A three draw. Okay. Interesting strategy, Gung Ho. Interesting. It's my first Lucifer in this form. Interesting. I don't have to evolve it now. Oh, four draws. Nice. Fantastic needs a four draw. Why is DQXQ in this event? They were good how many years ago? Why were they voted in? Hey, I never got this card before, at least. Bum. But it, oh, never mind. I have. Well, my excitement was pretty high. But I get... I should get seven more extra rolls, ladies and gentlemen. I would love a New Year's Fair rule for sure. Wait, shouldn't I get a four as well? I'm, I'm just going to keep going. 
I need a four draw on my other account when I think about it, though, for sure. Come on. Rathene! Big money! Something like shiny and bubble. No, I want bubbly and flamey. Bubblies! I want bubblies! Bubblies! Blue! Br Get out of here. Well, okay, Al Getty. You've tempted me on both accounts. Not bad! Wait, I get a four draw. Why does it say pull another three times? Should it be another four times? Like three drug is three rolls or is the, are they all just three bonus rolls? Because in my head, it should be three. I mean four. How does it work? We're gonna find out. Come on, big money. Okay, it is four. Interesting, display bug. Another one of her. Bubblies, I want bubblies. I like bubbly, it's my icon and eight player for a reason. Come on, bubbles and flip. I've never rolled you before. Never mind, I have rolled you before. How did I skip that evolution then to make his, oh, I skip it, I see. I do skip that evolution, never mind. Yeah, okay. Another Raffine. You know what? I like duplicates. I can have a team of Raffine on Raffine with more Raffines. Either way, interesting times all around. When I think about it, that was definitely 50 stones well spent. When you think about it, that was definitely a great amount of stones well spent. What an interesting image. Has anyone seen an image like this before? Because I have never. That is pretty interesting. Like, two Raffines, two of the red girls whose name I can't pronounce. I can definitely make some Raffine weapon assists now with no fear. No fear. You know what? This is an interesting image. It's worth taking a picture of. Alrighty. I do need a four drawn fantastic. I don't have a four drawn fantastic somehow. Somehow. Come on, big money. Give me that sh bubbly and flamey. I love bubbles. That's a lot of seven stars or higher. Bubbles! Bubbles! I like bubbles! I'll take a bubble bath tonight if it's flamey and bubbly. I'll light a candle for the fire. Hey! I don't have Nocteria! I wanted her from I don't know how many, like, whenever she came out, I wanted her. She was, like, one of the first, like, spinner to winner people. And she does at least come with, like, a natural blind resist, which can be pretty sweet for some setups. But very nice. Never got one before. I am happy getting something for the first time. I'm always happy if it's something new. Bum, bum, da dum, bum, bum, ba da dum, bum, bum. Again, Elfrede, again! I didn't have enough, apparently. Oh, shiny and bubbly, 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 flamey and bubbly. Bubbles! I've never got a Saphira! This is great. I'm getting the Godfest exclusives I don't have. Maybe I can start playing with yellow boxes. Like, yellow boxes I could play with. And right now, I think I'm four for four, ladies and gentlemen. I think I'm actually four for four. This is pretty magical. I can play with yellow boxes. I can play a feral. What should I play with next? Come on. Let's get that five for five. Let's get the dream, Shory P. The dream is about to be here. We're so close. And you know what? At this exact moment is the most exciting adrenaline rush I'm going to have because I'm on the cusp of five out of five. But not knowing is almost as exciting as knowing. And right now, as soon as I touch the screen, it goes to Safira and I can favor her. She does have a weapon assist, which I'm not going to make because I want to actually play with her instead. I could make it probably a pretty cool VDP team with that VDP buff. This is actually big VDP damage now. Oh, Tachibana! Why did you ruin it? Oh, Tachibana, you are terrible. Get out of here. <laughs> Oh, so close. So close to the magic of five for five. There's like almost no seven star pantheons and it has to be the last one there. Imagine if it was like a 10 drop. I'd be completely happy with that outcome. But yeah, Tachi Bana is a dream killer. She's not, she was useful at one point in time for ever so slight slither, like a tiny, tiny period she was useful. And now she's just here to troll me. But at the same time, I now have five L free days. What will I do with them all? I could make weapon assists. At least three of them are nice in a system. Because I can I can self-pair? I don't know. I have too many now. This is interesting. I know. Why is she voted instead of Kenshin? I think Kenshin is one of the better Pantheon cards. I would love to have more than one copy of him, I think. 
Oh, I'm getting closer to the all elf free day team, which is actually a bad idea, Curl, because you know you're never gonna have a good enough board for it. <sighs> so close, but so magical. Alrighty. Kale bad. I think also the way they set it up was pretty dumb. Like the voting system was pretty dumb how they set it up. Like you couldn't vote for the cool stuff. You don't even know what the name of the card is. So people just probably picked what they recognized. And cards like Sakuya, who was like the most voted Pantheon card, is probably just a recognizable card. They're like, oh, I know what this card is. I'll vote for it. That's probably like what happened. Wait, is set in here? We're not all set for that. Come on. Big money. I think I might stop after this. Okay, okay, okay. Come on, Alfred again? Fujin, Indra. Nope. Yes! I don't have these six stars yet, so this is actually nice for myself. Never got a Mayfang. Um, she's got some cool weapon assists. Like, look at that. OE's three attribute. Cleric active skill. Definitely something I would probably utilize. Five attribute awakening, just straight up. I would rather use the Monster Hunter five attribute awakening personally, just because of the longer base cooldown. And the light sub attribute is actually probably going to be in a, a nerf unless they had no sub attribute to begin with. Should I do one more set of five? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is technically the best time to get flamey and bubblies. Technically. All right. One more five pull, and then I'm going to stop here. Come on, big money. Yes, yes, yes. Gold, get out of here! Oh. Well, that was a true disappointment, unfortunately. Okay. I don't give this roll a 10 out of 10. At least Antares is a good gold egg, I guess, but I don't need more. I know, Kuro. I know. Bum, bum, ba -da -dum, bum, bum, bum. You know what? I still feel like rolling New Year's for some reason, even though I know it's a stupid idea, so I'm not going to do it. I'll probably just exchange for Lutina in the future. So, yeah. I definitely cleaned up with... So I definitely came out ahead, I'd say, overall. Like, ignore that DQ and XQ. I got so many of these girls now, I don't understand. I guess I could make a team out of this if I really wanted to, but can I even do anything remotely useful? Fire... I, I could play three colors, too. You trade it for Lutina for a Feral Equip? Wait, how does that work, Kuro? Oh, you got Lutina to make a Feral Equip. As a Feral Equip, I understand. But yeah, pretty good when I think about it. Got... How many Godfits exclusives? One, two, Raphine... Three of that girl again. Four of Raphine. Nocteria five. Six that girl. Like, I will th all three copies this Godfest, actually. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I came out ahead just because of the bonus rolls, I think, to be honest. So, pretty good rolls overall. Like, I got some new Godfest exclusive I didn't have, like Safira. And Nocteria. So I, I feel like I definitely should try make a Safira team happen at some point. At some point. And hello, Decknast. Welcome back to the stream. How are you doing today? And wow, Deucer, congrats getting your second one. Yes, Curl, that's definitely a magical weapon assist. But bro, what happened? You will see what happened in the rolling video when I upload it to the internets and YouTubes. So, on this happy and high note, hopefully all you lovely ladies and gentlemen have a truly fantastic day. I wish the best on your own pad adventures, and happy puzzling.